We are expecting uh, in three days the eruption in the Swartzing volcanic system near the town of the Grindavik to happen. Uh, we have evidence for the rising of the magma and the swelling up of the ground measured by the GPS data, the distance between the ground and the satellites in the air orbit. And we are now at the highest level of this since the eruptions began in the last year. So what we need for this magma to flow is some good amount of the earthquakes, the earthquakes which actually can shake the ground and make the magma, like a ketchup, become more fluid. Uh, magma is a non-Newtonian fluid to flow toward the surface. And surprise, surprise, we have all along the plate boundary between the North American plate and the Eurasian plate, all kind of earthquakes coming. And we had also waved the earthquakes in the Reconista. Uh, Thorvaldo Thodorson, the professor of the volcanology at the University of Iceland, due to this believes that the eruption is imminent within three days at least. And uh, he relates that the Reconista earthquakes, the swarm of the earthquakes, is related to the magma accumulation. Of course, I have to disagree on this because uh, all of the earthquakes we are seeing at the depth of the uh, 9 to 4, 5 kilometers happened, but we don't have any evidence for the accumulation of the magma. This is the GPS data from the nearby area in that Reconista, and we don't see that. But I hope that the eruption happens and he will be right because that is something we are waiting for.